Hi, Fred here for Tuesday Tent Talks. We have a customer, Dave, that wrote in last week, and we encourage you guys to send in at tttwemaketents.com with any of your questions. So Dave writes in and says, what is the best way to fold up a hip end tent? He says he has a lot of problems, it's an odd shape, and he would like to know the best way. So we're gonna go over to the factory floor and see what the difference is between factory pack and a couple of different ways that we have and we've asked some customers how to, the best way is to roll up a hip end tent. Let's go take a look. All right, I'm back with Fred Brown. Fred Brown, how long have you been here at the company? 12 years. 12 years. Fred Brown's been here with us 12 years. He runs, oversees our fabric division, our two shifts, and he's going to help us out today and answer this question, what's the best way to fold a hip end tent? He's also got his assistant, Chamu. You're going to do it. So the first thing we're going to do is show you how we factory pack it. There is a difference between factory packed and what I would put my tents in the bag going out to a rental. So Fred, go ahead. Shimu, thanks for helping us. He's going to point out a couple things. Okay. we got our lace line in the rope. Hold it. You flip it over so you can see your buckle. Your tag will be facing down. So when you go to roll it up, this is factory pack. When you go to roll it up, it'll be up underneath and we'll be able to see it at the end. So you guys can take a look at it. Um, the corners have your little tie back. When, once you uh, once you get your tent set up on the top, you're going to want to tie this to the corner fitting, and then tighten up your rope so it's so it's actually snug. We we leave it loose so you guys can pull on it. You know? That piece of the corner there, Frank. Go back to that piece of the corner. So that piece of the corner keeps the tent down on the corner so it doesn't creep up. A lot of people yeah. don't know that it's not to pull the tent over the top. It's to tie it to the, fitting, to the fitting, so it keeps the top from creeping back up. And you don't right. get any wind whip. Alright, there you go. Another thing here, the tag on the tent always matches with the bag tag. Yep. If you ever get to a park or someplace where they need to know the flame retardancy on it, this tag will always match the tent. I know it's hard when you guys take the tents down to make sure that piece goes back into that bag, but if you do it, you're going to have matching tags, you don't have to open it up. So this will be factory pack, and then you want to tighten the sidewall ropes the first time you do it. So, thank you for watching us do the factory pack. Now we're going to show you how we're going to do how the rental. The rental pack. Yep. All right. Okay, so move. The only difference is with the rental pack is you'll never see your tag because they always flip it into the center. So, center. Center. Now I'm going to give you another way that we can do it. There's many, many different ways. There's a lot of different ways. And if you have a way, please send it in to us at tttwemaketents.com. I'm going to show you another way. What I like to do is take the valance and tuck it in so it protects the buckles so the buckles don't rub on the top. So they're tucking the valance in underneath. He's going to tuck it in on the sides. So what that does, it just adds a little cushion for it. He's going to fold it to the middle. And then tuck the valance in on this side again. Fold it into the middle. Okay. Fold that a half again, and then half again. And then that's the center of the tent. And then, Chamu, you're going to roll to Fred. Now roll that, no, go ahead, you roll that right there like that. And then your center's right there, you can put it onto the frame, roll it out, put the two laces together into the grommet side and roll the tent top out.
All right, Dave, thanks for writing in. I hope that helps you out. And if you have a way to fold the tent or a topic you'd like us to cover here at Tuesday Tent Talks, please email us in at tttwemaketents.com. See you next week on Tuesday Tent Talks.